Okay, hey guys, Christoph here, um, and I'm back with the boss fight ending. Sorry about that, my camera seems to cut off again, but if you see the description of my other video, then you'll know that I uh, said I'd upload the ending for it. And done. There we go. Sorry about that, guys, but this is the second part of part. Three. Who's the boss now? Okay, where are we up to? <clears throat> now Darby is oh, sweet to chapter three. Level in Love makes the world go round. So it will surprise none of you to discover in a future life he'll end up in Congress. But this is my story, not his. With the trust fund babies under control, it's time to turn my attention to their sworn enemies, those greaseball kids. Well, technically they come to you, but whatever. So, you must be pretty proud of yourself. You taught those rich scum a lesson. They're rich, weak bullies. Yeah, Greaser approaches Jimmy and asks him for his help because the Greaser faction leader is called Johnny Vincent. And he wants Jimmy's help, but obviously Jimmy isn't obviously a charity worker or anything like that. Okay, small offences, cooks crush. Oh god, what the hell's going on with uh, Pete's eyes? They're fucked up. Okay. Let's carry on with a few more missions. Make this video a bit longer. Because obviously I'm just going to be uploading the beginning of chapter 3. Because there'll be like 30 seconds worth of footage and it's not really worth doing. So she want to get okay. Balls of snow. Hey, yeah. Okay, we'll do that one. Oh, chemistry too. No thanks. Get off. Sorry about that. Fat bastard. Oh, brother. <laughs> okay. Balls of snow. Okay. The gist of this mission is that a um, a whole ball dressed as Santa Claus is getting terrorized by children and he wants revenge, so Jimmy obviously takes pity on him. Um, and helps him get rid of the hence by throwing these balls of snow. Okay, good. Keep it up. Not bad. I wanna You've got to uh, yeah. avoid hitting the adults, otherwise Ruby the Red Nose Santa will get busted and then you fail, so yeah. Oh shit. I'm glad you lost it. It's mainly the Tony kids that are terrorising him. <laughs> okay, it's glitched out though, he's stuck. Oh shit. Got him. Yes. That wasn't too tricky. Hey! Whoa, hey, oh, easy! Oh. Thanks. You're alright. Oh. And the collapse. Oh, oh, whoa! Well. Merry Christmas, you maniac. Okay. Reindeer antlers on what? Lovely. Alright. I'm done. I said Cook's crush. Let's do that.
Yeah, someone just got run over. I don't know if you saw that, but they did. Great. Oops. Never mind. Everybody really, really wants my your help. Pardon my phone. Okay, well, the cook has a bit of a thing for the chemistry teacher, Dr. Watts. And she needs to get ready for the date, so you need to obviously go around and um, get some items that she requires. Get perfume from the staff room. This guy who's chasing me, it's not him, it's the other guy that we just saw. He's the lucky guy, if you can call it that. Not too bad. Okay, what next? Get some chocolate. some chocolates from Fatty. Um, Five dollars for chocolates? Are you fucking mental? Rip off. Why not just go to Yum Yum Market? Never mind. Okay, find some sedatives. Oh god, wait for it. Oh! Um, okay. Where are the others? Another one for the collection. Okay, I got a transistor. Where are the sedatives? Oh, there they this are. Got okay. Return to Edna with the items. That hobo guy is not well. Never mind. Just say get out of the way. When you over it, it's your fault. Really, really bad driver. If I was 50 years older, I'd date you myself. Ah, thanks, kid. Okay, um, you give her the items and she asks you for another favour, which is to basically 
watch over her and uh, yeah, Dr. Really Watts' date. Stop the other kids from terrorising you. So anyway, I think this is a good time to uh, end the video here. So yeah, sorry about the camera cutting off um, in the last video, but hopefully this makes amends for that. So yeah, till next time, stay cool.